I'd like to regale an extraordinary tale whose moral may disconcert you. You see, it's about a mother and wife who for most of her life was famed for domestic virtue. She had two strapping daughters and a rather dull son and a much duller husband who had 61 elected to retire and later on expire. Sing hallelujah, hey no ni no, hey no ni no, hey no ni no, he joined the feathered choir. Having laid him to rest at special request in the family mausoleum. As his widow repaired to the home they had shared, her heart sang a gay te deum. And then in the middle of the funeral wake, while adding some liquor to the tipsy cake, she briskly cried, that's done. My life at last begun. Sing hallelujah, hey no ni no, hey no ni no, hey no ni no, it's time I had some fun. Today, though hardly a jolly day, at least has set me free. We'll all have a lovely holiday on the island of Capri in a bar on the Piccola Marina. Life called to Mrs. Wentworth Brewster. Fate beckoned her and introduced her into a rather queer, unfamiliar atmosphere. She'd just sit there, propping up the bar beside a fisherman who sang to a guitar. When accused of having gone too far, she'd merely say, Funiculi, just fancy me, Funicula. When he bellowed, Que bella, signorina! Sheer ecstasy at once, Produced a wild shriek from Mrs. Wentworth Brewster, changing her whole demeanor. When both her daughters and her son said, Please come home, Mama, she murmured rather bibulously, Who oh, do you think you are? Nobody can afford to be so lardy bloody da. In a bar on the Piccola Marina. Every fisherman cried, Viva, viva, and gay regazza. When she sat on the grand piazza, everybody would rise. Every fisherman sighed, Viva, viva, cabel inglese. Someone even said, Oops, a dicey, which was quite a surprise. Each evening, with some light excuse and beaming with goodwill, she'd just slip into something loose and totter down that hill. To the bar on the Piccola Marina Where love came to Mrs. Wentworth Brewster Hot flushes of delight suffused her right around the bend She went, picture her astonishment Day in, day out she would get about Because she thought she was no longer on the shelf Night out, night in, knocking back the gin, she say, Rip, vaniculi, vanicula, vanic yourself. Just for fun. Three young sailors from Messina bowed low to Mrs. Wentyworth Brewster, said, Oh, scusi, and abruptly goosed her. Then there was quite a scene. Her family in floods of tears said, Leave these men, Mama. She said, They're just high spirited, like all Italians are. And some of them have a great deal more to offer than Papa. Ha ha! In a bar on the Piccola Marina.